This is not good at all. I'm gonna quickly rest and then. Oh my gosh! Okay. Oh, I feel like we're coming to the end. I don't want it to end. I really don't. I've, I hope it's not the end. I really like this game. Welcome. I believe in the green. The green is good. <laughs> Each of our beaches is a single capillary. But Armalis Beach is the heart that pumps blood to the rest of us. Capillaries oh. are subordinate to the greater whole. A which whole means governed by that the if we heart, kill the main which thing, gives everything else direction, dies. Which dictates flow which dictates everything controls everything don't you see she is in control she's controlling you it yeah after doing the chiral network it made her more powerful but having done so she wants you wants yeah. you to go to her for sure that's her final wish that's why she didn't want Fragile to help them back before. If you can't make her see reason, you'll have to kill her. And if you kill her... Everything dies. You'll save the world, but you'll be stranded outside of it. No. Forever. <sighs> oh, I thought everything dies, but that's even worse. No, I don't want that to happen to my character. I know you love her. You love her. Oh. There. Oh, that split second blink when she said that. I feel like he was like, no, not anymore. <laughs> Still chapter 12 though. I feel like there's still a lot that's unanswered. God. Oh god. So much blood. I said run along the beach, so I guess I'm gonna just run along the beach. Oh. Oh, 
the hello oh, okay oh she's wearing black ah! oh god has oh, already god. begun Suddenly, <gasps> Bridget, you're too late. What took you so long? It's Bridget. Your voice. That's not Amelie. Oh God. You still don't know who I am, do you? Who are you? She's wearing the mask. Sam, you were supposed to stop me. Stop all of this. Um, bitch. Bridget? Yes. It's me, Sam. Where's Amelie? Where she's always been? Nowhere. My daughter, Samantha America Strand, doesn't exist. What? Amelie doesn't exist. Not in your world. I've had to wear a mask for so long. This is Bridget. Emily and Bridget are both a part of me. But then what's your name? What's that supposed to mean? Quiet, and I'll tell you. There is no time for questions. Listen. Okay. Just listen. Okay. Story time. <laughs> it's not one of them. Killing you would be a terrible mistake. I know that. Uh huh. Because I've been on a shit journey. <laughs> well, actually, it was a beautiful journey. It was worth it. The sixth extinction will happen either today or tomorrow. You can either end it with dignity, quick, clean, and in a flash, or you can struggle in vain, knowing full well what's waiting come the finish. Those are your choices. <sighs> please don't make me let me don't please don't let me make the choice. You kept it all this time. Oh. Oh, I do have to make a choice. <laughs> I have to make the choice. I shot her. That happened. <laughs> Guys, I don't want this to end. No, I don't want the world to end. I literally just shot her. What happened? You lie. Oh, okay. She bleeding. <laughs> yeah. Sorry. saying because a lot of people did this I, I had no I did everything I didn't put the gun I pointed the gun away from her I put the gun down not gun, not the gun down sorry I didn't do this I didn't unequip it but I didn't point it at her I didn't shoot her and twice I got apparently the bad ending so I did check and it says to unequip the gun that's all I found out I don't know what's gonna happen after I do this so let's just do this it's just yeah I don't wanna Let's just not waste time. Can I do anything? <laughs> oh, hug. Oh. I'm here for you. Always. Like you were for me. 
You found the common thread. The strand that links them together. And you did that the only way possible. To live life one day at a time. you here. Yeah, I tried. <laughs> but it still has a role to play. It was the bonds between people that brought the world together. And if that is what matters most to you, then I will stay here on this beach. And I will shut myself in and the rest of you out. Shut yourself in. Come on. Once the last stranding starts, it can't be stopped. I can't go with you. All I can do is try to spare you the worst. Alone? That's what an E.E. does. Oh, I'll go If I had just done my job... None of this would have happened. Oh god, I need a pause because I just want to talk like I know I call her bad names and stuff, but like talk like listening to her talk, I feel like literally it made it did give me a perspective now. Like imagine how she felt. Like she couldn't tell them the truth all this time. Like because she's not like Amelie, she's not an Bridget, she's an EE, like an extinction entity. And it's just so sad, like being alone, like she has to cut herself out so that no one else gets hurt. And oh God, I feel so bad. Like she really annoyed me, but I understand now why, because she was cutting everyone out. But at the same time, I don't know, it was like, like, yeah, we needed perspective. Like all this time we thought like, oh, she was bad and stuff, but she's not. Like she didn't want this to happen. Like it, ha it just happened and unfortunately, she influenced some people, including Higgs and stuff, but oh my god! Okay, I'm gonna shut up. I, I couldn't take it anymore. I got so tired of waiting, and I figured that no one would blame me if I just got it all over with. See, she, she didn't want to be alone. That's what I did. She wanted to be connected to people. Sounds like hell. Oh shit, that gra <laughs> <We'll always be laughs> graphics. Oh, credits. Wait, I finished the game? Wait, what? Okay, just, let's see what happens. Did it finish? No, I don't want it to end. Try! Thank you for making King so amazing! Yeah, Nicholas Winding Refuge. I don't know how to say his name, but he was amazing. I love this character. Hotman was amazing. I don't know what to do. I'm just running around. Jess Cordy. I think she did the voice of Armelie. I'm pretty sure. You're making me run around again? Okay, I can talk about it now. Um, no, but I was gonna say the controls. A few of them were a little bit out of place. That, that those are really my main concerns. The story loved it, um, and even I know a lot of people complained about the fact that um, it was a struggle to get through some of the delivering. But I adored it. Like the grind, like building up and working towards getting more like story was something that I love, and that's something I always like. Like, Kingdom Hearts kind of does that for me, and that's why I love it. Like, you have to fight the Heartless, and you have to get past certain stages to get to parts of the story. So that's kind of something I expected from this game. And, um, I enjoyed it. And that's why when people come to me, like, now, who are playing it, and they're saying, like, oh, they hate, for example, Chapter 3, and I've spoken about this, Chapter 3 is the most like challenging because i hated that chapter too and i literally was on the verge of quitting as well but when you pass it you fly through the game and the story and i feel like and and that, i think that's what kojima was putting in front of us like a challenge like how far we would be willing to go to put this world back together oh okay i was also gonna say 
um, <laughs> she rudely interrupted, um, that, like, Hideo Kojima has covered some really, like, heavy, um, themes, especially about death and loss, and obviously this game is about different times of, types of loss, um, the loss of a child, the loss of a wife or a husband, the loss of an identity, the loss of oneself to a certain thing, um, Oh, is he getting tired again? No, okay. Um, but yeah, it's just so sad. Like, there are some themes that really hit me hard. Um, and especially, definitely Mamas and Heartmans, because those ones I was just like, whoa! Like, holding back the tears, Heartman, I cried, because it's just, it's so sad. And um, even with Mama, Mama, I was crying. <laughs> I was just holding it back. And I cried afterwards, like, after I finished, like, filming and playing, because it was just, it was so beautiful. And that's the thing, it sticks with you, and it makes you think. And that's something I love and adore about video games, when the, the writer and the director put something in front of you and are like, here you go, make use of it, and think, of, think on it. So that's why I was like, holy crap, it's amazing. Okay, I'm getting tired again, need to sit down, and, oh, wait, <gasps> what? <gasps> was my theory right? <gasps> my theory was right! That's Sam! Sam is Cliff's son! Oh, okay. Different, different. Oh. Sam. Oh, God. Oh, okay. Finally. <laughs> oh, the gun! This was from the trailer. <gasps> A gun won't help you here, but it still has a role to play. Oh god, please don't- oh no! <gasps> what? What? <gasps> 